In this video, I'm going to show you a few of the techniques available on the 4 series, 5 series, and 6 series mixed signal oscilloscopes. We're going to set up our display so that we can see everything that's going on with less clutter in the display. Let's go ahead and add a results table to show our measurements and hide away the measurement batch. I'm going to move this to the top of our screen and then rescale it so that we see just a few rows at one time. It's really easy to scroll through this table and see all the different measurements. The next thing I'm going to do is hide some of these math waveforms. I want to keep math waveforms 1, 2, and 3 in memory, but it looks like we're probably done with 4, 5, and 6. I just slide them down for them to be deleted. Now channels 1, 3, and 5 are differential voltage measurements, and channels 2, 4, and 6 are current measurements. I can either reorder my channels here on the bottom by putting 1, 3, and 5 next to each other, like so, or I can group them together so that they're overlaid. By dragging and dropping channels, I can go ahead and group them together. 1, 3, and 5 are now grouped. Let's do 2, 4, and 6 next. And I can add a callout to document what's in that area. Make sure you have the latest version of firmware installed on your instrument to use all of these features.